Blessed are the meek, for they shall inherit the earth. These words were spoken nearly 2,000 years ago. And they were spoken to a gathering of unenlightened, uninformed, but nevertheless curious and receptive people. Spoken by Jesus the Christ, who had that deep abiding awareness that of what he was speaking was the truth. He had the vision to look into what we call the future and perceive that there would be a time when humanity would awaken from its sleep and its, its awakening would let go of who it believed itself to be and come to a place of enlightened awareness where it would individually and collectively reveal the age of Aquarius to where truth would cover the planet in such a wave of enlightenment that humanity would finally reach that place of living its true nature. Individually, this is referencing you in your present incarnation. It is speaking of you in your awakening as you move from a place of egoically centered confusion and misunderstanding to a recognition that this is not who you truly are. And in your recognition of this, to let it go. And in your releasing of this identification, to see many things about yourself that you had come to believe to be true, which no longer hold truth for you, but rather leave you at a place of receptivity. And in that inner receptivity, to become aware of you, the manifest being who animates a physical body to interact with any and all others on this plane of existence. And so you choose to do so from an enlightened position of realizing, I no longer need to live who I believe myself to be. I can step across that threshold of fear and enter into that dimension of what I had before considered unknown and realize that in reality it is me awakening that translates into me remembering who I truly am. And this is what is happening to your world now. This is what is occurring with humanity. You may see it from the perspective of the resistance that is offered up by ego amongst the many because it realizes its days truly are numbered. Or you can begin to go within and in your inner awareness realize that this is occurring with you personally. That as you learn to be still, you find that in the stillness you experience yourself, and as yourself, you're able to witness or observe the interactions that before you unconsciously merely identified with. So in this today, it is a message of resurrection. It is a message of transformation. It is a message of awakening from who you believed yourself to who you are becoming. May you take this in your heart and from this heart perspective find that you are embracing all and with your embrace 
you find all is embracing you. Blessings to you until we meet again. For more information about the Metaphysical Church of Enlightenment or the Rodin Foundation, please go to our website at www.rodin.org. If you have been inspired by the revelations shared in these podcasts, please donate to the Rodin Foundation's ongoing efforts to help others help themselves at www.rodin.org.